to get some more supplies and now we are ready to move on to the next phase of the shed build. Yeah, so we're gonna go ahead and put the burn strips on for all the siding and go ahead and uh, get that metal roof on there so it gets uh, dried in. Yeah, so we read through a lot of the comments and you guys had some great suggestions and thoughts on what we were going to do with the peaks of the shed yep. and as, if you remember from our last video we were talking about doing something that would allow some natural light in um, but we have decided to kind of backtrack and go back to just putting up plywood yeah. and our reasoning for that is we don't want to put our money and our time into making the shed fancy after we sat back and thought about it for a while like our focus is the house the house yeah and moving that forward so um not you know diving into getting crazy with this thing so we decided we're just going to go ahead and put the osb i keep calling it plywood but it's osb, OSB and then we'll slap up the uh, siding and uh, we'll probably put a big old red star right there yeah <laughs> <laughs> or which whatever by, which by the way is an american barn star we get questions about that all the time i yeah. guess they're technically i never really knew there was a name for them but i guess they're technically called like a primitive star or american barn star for us it's just been something that's traveled from like house to house with us over the years and then yeah. happened to match the barn roof on this so anyways sidetracked for a second but okay. that's it so we're back are you ready to get started let's go all right you started a fire somewhere deep in my mind see the fire the place is thrown all cause I don't know Okay guys, so the first thing we did, we took a uh, standard circular saw, the roof in the back, we, take a, we took a uh, wood cutting blade, we turned that thing backwards and it cut through that thing like butter. So that's the first thing we did, we went ahead and cut it all, then we went ahead and stacked everything over top, 
and I laid the first panel out one time and I drilled through all the panels so all the holes for all the screws are in the same exact location so once we put the roof up the, the uh, screws are going in a perfect nice line so it's aesthetically pleasing to the eye um, the side we did cut that's going to go up and the ridge cap is going to cover that cut and uh, the overhang will hang off that side will be obviously uncut so now that we have everything prepped we're going to go ahead and put these closures in these closures are going to go under the metal panel that's at the edge of the overhang so no bugs can go underneath the panels
All right, so we got the milk panels up. We did not get done as much as we wanted to get accomplished today. It's like every other day we do this. Yes. Yeah. We, have a, we have big goals, and uh, there's always a lot of shortcomings on those goals. Yeah, right? it, things tend to take a little bit longer um, than we plan, and if we ever have to run into town, that's pretty much like a guarantee that we should just know by now it's if we're going to town. It's a two and a half to, to three hour loss every time we go to town. Yeah. So it kind of sucks. I don't think we've learned our lesson to like drop our, our goals when we go into town on those days. Well... <laughs> So we got the metal panels up, the ridge caps on, it's vented. Um, what else we got? That's it. That's all we did. That, yeah, that's it. Um, we don't have the rake on yet, so nope. we're going to wait and hold off on that until we're doing the soffit and the siding. Yep. So tomorrow we're going to pick up where we left off today, which is going to be getting the furnace strips on. Yeah, do the furnace strips, start the siding, get the yes. soffit buttoned up, get everything done so we can get electric. Yep. So that's Can't it, guys. Wait. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time. Yep, see ya. Hi, nah. You go up this ladder, I need you getting hurt, nah. Okay? Don't step on your beard now. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs>